Today, I'm going to show you the difference between a bevel and a miter. The question is, what are they? I'm going to show you right now. When it comes down to trim, everybody wants to have that perfect corner. Now, how do we achieve that? Is it a bevel? Is it a miter? Well, the technical aspects between the two cuts is literally which way you rotate the saw. Think of the x-axis going across. Think of the y-axis coming up and down. Now, the y-axis is actually the rotation of which way we go for a miter. So, you can think y is miter. And when you want to lay the saw left to right, that is called the bevel. So, the bevel is on the x-axis. So, if I was going to use my bevel, I would use it when I have a larger baseboard or a larger piece of trim. Basically, the throat plate on my saw allows me to have 14 inches of clearance. So, if I had something 14 inches, I know I could cut it here. Otherwise, we're going to move over to the table saw. Regardless, with trim, we look at the difference between the two cuts. When it comes into baseboard, you look at the corners and you always think those are miters. In actual fact, these are our bevel cuts. Because the trim is small, you can stand it up, but you are achieving a bevel. Because the cut of a bevel is in the vertical direction. Versus the miter is when we lay it down and we're doing a window casing and it goes around and it's in the horizontal direction. This is our miters. So, Hopefully that helps and you get a little bit more understanding on how to do these cuts. Well, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe to my channel and leave a comment below. I'd love to hear what you have to say.